Hello everybody, and today, um, before you guys ask, why am I making a video of me cooking some macaroni and cheese? Now, um, I just want to make something today, so, I have a fun fact, I used to have a cooking channel, then I gave that channel away long ago. So today we'll be cooking Velveeta Shells and Cheese, the Oscar Mayer or Meyer Bacon. It says it's made with real cheese, as you can see. This is the back of it. Um, here's the efficient facts, as you can see. It's so blurry a little bit. So uh, it's 360 calories. But this is actually the directions. You got a boil of six cups of water, cook to eight to 10 minutes. Drain pasta, do not rinse, return to pan, blah, blah, blah. So what we're going to do, so before we actually start get cooking, I got the pan right here, which we are going to add. We're going to add six cups of water, as you can see. Let me go do that really quick, and I'll be back. All right, the first thing we need to do, we're going to have uh, six cups of water. So we got two cups here. So I already did the second one already, so we're going to do the third one here. So it's something look like this, as you can see in the pot. Now we're going to turn the stove on low, as you can see. So now we're going to wait for this to boil. And I'll be back. Well, before we, I'll be right back. Here guys, the inside of the box. While we wait for the water to boil, let's open up the box, as you can see. As you can see, sometimes it takes a little bit for me to get the box open. So as you can see, All right, so we got the box open. We got your shells in there. We got your um, you got your cheese sauce packet, as you can see. And we also got your bacon bits. And after all, we got the noodles in there. So let's wait for the water to boil, and I'll be back. According to the box, you will need to let the um, noodles in and boil once you put the noodles in, you have to leave it boiled to 8 to 10 minutes. So I'll have a stopwatch timer on my iPhone. And I'll have to be very careful since it's it's really hot. It's the pan, the, the pot's hot. So normally you can use like a spoon. For me, I might have to use this spoon to stir it and everything. So just want to do this correctly since I haven't cooked macaroni cheese uh, since my cringe days. Probably 2019-ish. All right, so as you can see, the water is boiling. So now we can take the Velveeta. We will part it in the pot and stir it just a little bit. Got to be very careful, so. Okay. So now what we're going to do now is now we're going to set the stopwatch timer. All right, and I'll be back once I stir it again. As you can see, we're at one minute. So according, like I said on the box, it says boil for eight to 10 minutes. So we're gonna stir again. As you can see. So once the eight minutes is up, guys, we will um, put it in the drainer. And I guess I'll be back. All right, as you can see, we're almost up to eight minutes. So I'm going to stir the thing one more time and see if we can get one of the noodles right here and see if it's tasty enough. Let me just dump a little water out really quick. Let's try it. Yep, that's good. All right. Now we are going to do is once the we're going to stop the um, stopwatch timer, as you can see. I'll, I'll just wait until it gets to seventeen. All right. Turn the stove off. 
Now I'm gonna get the drainer over there. So what you need to do, I know I apologize for the sink, everybody. We're gonna carefully get the pot and we're gonna drain all the water out. As you can see. We'll shook it up a little bit. Okay. After all it's out, we can carefully put the noodles back in the pot. As you can see, we can try to get some of it. All right, now we will go back to the, um, oh, God, sorry about that. Anyways, let's go pour the cheese in. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to open up the cheese sauce packet, as you can see. As you can see the inside. We are going to pour the cheese in the pot, as you can see. I actually tried the cheese on this before. It's actually really good, by the way, guys. Fun fact I like about Velveeta is you don't have to put like milk or butter in, which is kind of cool. Sometimes I'll eat the Kraft macaroni and cheese for dinner sometimes. Okay, that's pretty much it of the cheese. Now we're going to get the uh, bacon bits right here. We're going to open that up as well. Well, let's see if we can get it. I'll show you the inside really quickly. I mean, you can't see, but we're going to pour that in too. All right, so now... Here comes the fun part, everybody. We are going to stir it up. That looks really good, guys. We're going to mix in the noodles and the pasta until it's all cheesy. So that's the best part about macaroni and cheese is you can... I like how it turns all yellow and everything. Because sometimes at home, I will cook the big bowl stuff, which is kind of like the cupped macaroni and cheese. So I keep moving the pot. I just, I don't know why it does that. And look at that. We officially cooked a Velveeta macaroni and cheese with the bacon ones. All right. That looks really good. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it of me cooking the Velveeta shell and cheese Oscar Mayer bacon. Thank you all for watching.